Hey everyone, I'm Dr. Leon here, and today we have a special request. Once again, another cool picture of a crying baby. So today we're gonna figure out how can we think and look at this and come up with something really cool to talk about. So right there, that little baby, anyone who has baby say I, right? I in the room say it. So that looks like ear infections, what do you think? Little baby's up all night having chronic ear infections, tugging on the ear consistently and utterly crying. What do we do? What do you do? Do you reach, grab for the Advil, the Motrin, the Tylenol, go to the pediatrician, get the antibiotic, and if you so, that's, that's coming, that's okay. But do you ever get a chiropractic checkup? Do you ever think of bringing this little baby, this amazing little thing right there, this little beauty right there? Do you ever think of getting maybe a chiropractic checkup to understand the relationship of how the spine works to your immune system, to the inner ear? If so, I challenge you to come on in and we'll do that for you right in front of you. We'll show you and explain this in detail. Option two, what do you look at? Maybe a little acid reflux, right? Uh, a little colic. Well, it looks a little calm for colic, but the truth is we can't hear. So if we can hear that and that's going on all night long and there's some colic or acid reflux concept, do you ever think of going for a chiropractic checkup? Do you ever think of this relationship between the esophagus, the brain, and the sphincter to the stomach? Do you ever think of that? Or did you just go right to a pediatrician, which isn't wrong, to get some kind of medication to calm the acid inside the belly? Did you try breastfeeding even longer to see if that calms or soothes the baby? Is there anything else we can think of by looking at this little kid? Yeah, of course, maybe this little guy's constipated. Teresa actually came up with that, she's awesome. So maybe, you ever think of constipation, what are you gonna do, give him tons of fake juice, prune juice? Are we gonna make him go? Are we gonna give him some drug to make him go to the bathroom? Or could it just be that tiny little sacrum is out of alignment which causes all of the neurological relationships to the parasympathetic nervous system, thereby allowing constipation to be there? So if any of these cool scenarios happen to ring a bell, what I challenge you to do is go and either here or another chiropractor, get a chiropractic checkup. Call up and go challenge yourself right now. If you'd like this number, 631-689-1000, say you saw a cool baby, all right, and we're gonna take good care of you for that day. Let's give you and your child a wonderful checkup. This is Dr. Leon, have a good day.